Nick, in the corner at the buzzer, exactly how it was drawn up? Uh, it was uh, it was part of the play. Uh, you know, the first look was for me to catch it and a uh, back cut for Evan. And uh, if that was not open, you know, for me to turn and shoot. And uh, I mean, Roy Hibbert is, you know, he's really tall. And uh, so I was just trying to, you know, get as much space as I can, uh, shoot as high as I can. And so I did work on that shot, but that one was a bit more luck maybe than, uh, you know, scale. But I mean, it was a you know, great shot. Um, you know, it's my first buzzer beater, so I'm, I'm going to enjoy this one. Game time decision in a buzzer beater. Yeah. How good does that feel? Uh, it feels great. Uh, you know, I did my, uh, you know, yesterday I didn't even practice, and this morning I came in, and I was supposed just to do, you know, some some work, you know, as a first step to get back out there, and then it felt very good, and I was like, you know, let me uh, see how I feel t today after I do my work on the court, and then maybe you know I, I'm good to go, and it felt pretty good. You know, um, it wasn't 100 percent, but it was good enough for me to be out there with my teammates, and uh, you know, it was really more just I want to be out there, you know. Um, I felt like you know they needed me out there. It's a, it's a important time for, for us now. Uh, we want to get back to 500. You no, know, we missed our first chance in Indiana, so we want to get our next one. And I want to be out there, so I'm glad I made that call. Did you, that's your first buzzer beater at any level? Yes, it is. Yeah. Okay. Uh, first one. Was that the, the best celebration you've been a part of after a game? No, that's probably one of the worst, but uh, <laughs> I really didn't know what to do. I was, uh, you know, when I was little, I used to, like, what am I going to do when I, but once you make that shot, you have no idea what to do. I uh, probably was just running around like an idiot. You know, <laughs> I don't even know. But uh, I mean, in the moment, you don't really think about it. You know, we just want to go out with your teammates and celebrate. You know, it's a great moment. I know last year when Tobias hit those two, you just run around and celebrate, you know, with each other. And, uh, and that's what makes it special, you know, that, that you can celebrate with the other guys. You guys just jump around. It's a happy moment. And uh, that's what makes it special. Nick, you guys have been on the other side of so many close losses. How good does it feel to finally get over the hump in one of these close games? Well, it feels very good, you know, in to uh, against Toronto. I, mean, I didn't play, but we were able to, you know, uh, win that one. And then uh, tonight, you know, another one, uh, a close game where we come up, come up on top. Uh, you know, we also didn't play very well. You know, I thought we, we should have played much better, uh, especially on defensive end. You know, we never really took them away from what they uh, do. You know, we never really um, sh show what we can do on defense. You know, they, they shot a high percentage. Uh, they were getting whatever they want. And, uh, you know, we, we got away with this one, but we have to play much better. First game ever with the Magic coming off the bench. Are you sixth man of the year now? Is that? No, I don't think that's something <laughs> we're going to keep doing. But, uh I mean, you know, it was a uh, coach decided to go that way because, you know, he said it was such close to the game and guys, you know, we went through shoot around with the first, uh, you know, with Dwayne being a starting lineup and you know, that was fine with that, you know, and uh, that's okay. But, you know, I, I want to go back to starting. Him, you know. <laughs> Channing and Shabazz had a, had a great yeah. night for you guys. Talk about their contribution. Oh, they were both great, uh, especially Channing, you know, in the first half, you know, he made some uh, threes. Uh, he made that buzzer at the end of the third quarter. Uh, you know, played very well on defensive end as well. You know, gave us a spark up the bench. And as for Baz, one point we were really, I think, offensive. We couldn't really get much going. And, uh, you know, he spread the floor for us, made a couple of big threes, uh, made some big shots. And uh, so they're both big, uh, great for us tonight. Uh, you know, we, we need guys like that to come off the bench and uh, give us a spark if things are not going well. And uh, both of them did that. Well, I guess I came off the bench too. So. Mm -hmm. yeah.